Good morning and welcome to Cunis RV Elkhorn, Wisconsin. It's a little sign because we are actually at Building D, which is where we do our PDI 1s. This is a new trade and I'm going to flip her around. By the way, Buck, hi. New trade that we brought in. This is a Montana High Country. Does have generator prep. It is lacking the generator though. We are dealing with an HM381TH. Solid steps on the rig. Not one, but two awnings. Storage underneath. Small pass through up front. Opposing 30 pound tanks. Underneath the slides all look great. Slide toppers on the rig. Again, prepped for it, but lacking the generator. Big battery compartment. Master disconnect switch. There's one little boo-boo on here, and it's a little scratch right there. All right. Again, underneath the slides look great. Awnings look great. Slide toppers look great. Check out the other side of the pass-through. Inverter on board. Very, very clean water bay. Master disconnect for the whole rig. Little plug-in for solar if you want to go at it. Very sharp. Very, very sharp. Continue on around. You have a very good amount of storage in here. All the fiberglass looks good. Ladder on board to do your roof maintenance. And here is your garage. It's 51 and a half by 81 and a half. Fire extinguisher on board. That's your switch for up and down on your master. You do have power in here. And the other side of the storage. I'm gonna pause this and put the bed down so I can show you the inside. All right, you guys, let's start it off in the front. I hope I mentioned this before, but she is extremely clean. She has no rips in the sofas, no fading, tele-TV, nice window up front, great cabinetry, love the fireplace. You want to have guests over? That's a trifold. That's a trifold. Got yourself some nice recliners. Floor looks sharp, not a glitch in it. Come down to the kitchen area. Give you a nice view real quick. Right here in the entry, you have all your lights, your power switches for your slides and your awnings, tank indicators. What else we got going on? Gas and electric on your water heater. Very big microwave. Nice three burner. Clean oven. Solid countertops. Divided metal sink. Nice touch. Love the cabinetry. Table and chairs. Yes, you can extend it out. I'm not going to play with it right now, though. Super size fridge. Nice little coffee nook. If you did want to put a generator in, your tank heaters, max airs, thermostat. Like the fact that that's there so that way when the slides are in, you can still get to it. Everything sharp as can be, including the floor. You come up here. 
Go into the bathroom. Lots of storage. Very deep. <laughs> Washer dryer unit. Stand up shower. Seat in the shower. I'm six foot tall and 255 pounds. I'm in here. Medicine cabinet sink. Interesting door. And the reason for that is so that you don't have to go downstairs to open the door to get into the bathroom. That is the reason. All right, back bedroom. Lots of wardrobe area in this big slide. Lots and lots and lots of storage. Storage in the back, storage behind the bed. Sharp looking bed. And no, you cannot store underneath it. Little sitting nook. Control for rear air conditioner. TV back here. And as we saw, yeah, big storage above, which is also the bathroom storage. And two in one washer dryer. Again, very sharp. They definitely did not smoke in it. I saw, I saw how cleanly she was. It is a very, very, very good unit. And I would love for you to come and see it. See y'all. Buck Osmond, Kunis RV. Have a good day.